Seriously? Okay, so it doesn't look like we're gonna be able to go outside and fly today. There's some craziness going on out there. I don't know what's happening, but we are in luck because Beta FPV has sent out their Meteor 65 Pro. That is a 1S brushless whoop with ELRS baked into it. To control all that, they sent over their ELRS Micro TX module. So I think what I'm gonna do is move some of the furniture around here, try to make some obstacles, and we'll just see what this ELRS tiny whoop can do. <laughs> Okay, so you might be saying to yourself, like a long range whoop, what is that good for? Like, why do you need Express LRS in a 1S tiny whoop? Are you really gonna fly it, you know, long range out into the mountains? And that's not really the point here. Really, it's all about having a better control link. I mean, in the past, most of the whoops that we've been flying have been on FreeSky D8, which is just, it's an old protocol. It doesn't go very far. It's not very reliable. And honestly, it's run by FreeSky. And what we've always wanted is like, we want the crossfire that we've had on our big quads and we wanted it baked into a whoop and they just, they wouldn't do it. And so Express LRS came out and said, you know what, we're going to fit into more form factors. We're gonna make tiny receivers and we're gonna put Express LRS into flight controllers, or at least we're gonna allow people like Beta FPV to. So the Meteor 65 Pro comes in this cool little carrying case. And on the inside includes a extra set of props, a screwdriver, a card with a QR code to get more information about the drone. We've got two of these Beta FPV batteries with the BT 2.0 connector. That should uh, allow for more amperage, more power. It's gonna allow for uh, more, more. It's gonna let you go woo, woo, woo. That kind of thing. You also get a USB cable. And then you also get this charger slash tester that you plug into battery on the testing side. And on the front, you get a little readout with your voltage. But then we can plug this into a USB-C connector. Ah, uh, ah, uh, USB-C. Uh, when you plug it into there, you got two slots to charge your batteries. And I really appreciate USB-C 
a modern input on these things. All right, I think that's uh, everything. You know, let's go fly.